Here are six steps for graphing sine and cosine. Sine and cosine are pretty similar in their setup and outline. The general form for sine or cosine is y equals a sine, in this case it's sine, but we could replace that with cosine. Parentheses b, parentheses x minus c, we close our parentheses, and then plus d. Each of these letters, a, b, c, and d, have significance in graphing sine and cosine. The amplitude is found by a. Amplitude tells us how high above the midline and how far below the middle of the graph this will go. So we use A for amplitude. To find the period, or how far the graph goes before it repeats, we do 2 pi over B if we're in radians, or 360 over B if we're in degrees. So let's see, we've got amplitude. B is not the period, but we use it to find the period. We use to find the period. All right, we're not going to really use C right now. It's going to come into play here soon, but for today, we'll, we'll skip C. It's actually a horizontal shift left and right, which we'll talk about later. Uh, the midline is a line that would go through the middle of our graph, the middle of our wave, and it's found by y equals d. The scale, meaning the frequency in which we plot our points, is the period divided by 4. We mostly use just the ones and zeros from our sine and cosine graph. These are the points with the ones and zero, like 0 degrees, 90 degrees, 180 degrees, 270 degrees, 360 degrees, and so on. Each of those positions on the unit circle have nice easy ones and zeros or negative ones. They're easy to plot. And the last step is to make a table with those, with those values around the unit circle. So the x's are our degrees or radians. So we have degrees or radians. And then the y values would be your height above the x-axis come from uh, the values for either sine or cosine around the circle. Your graph is going to look like this. It's a wave. Now make sure when you graph these, you don't make a V shape. It's got to be curved, just like a circle is curved. And those are the six steps for graphing sine and cosine. So one, again, is amplitude. Two is period. Three, midline. Four is scale. Five is use the circle to make six the table.